Have you ever wondered if life could exist in space? But what if it already does, in the form of microorganisms, that too, ones that are evolving faster than we can imagine? Imagine for a moment the vast expanse of space where conditions are extreme and life as we know it seems impossible. Yet, there in the harsh environment of the International Space Station, we find life flourishing. Not just any life, but bacteria, the simplest form of life, adapting and mutating at an unprecedented rate. It's not just surviving, but thriving, becoming more resilient, more adaptable. In a place where survival seems improbable, these microscopic beings are rewriting the rules of biology. But this is not just about the survival of bacteria, it's about the survival of life itself. It's about the potential for life beyond our planet, beyond our comprehension. It's about understanding the very essence of life and the incredible adaptability it possesses. It's a conundrum, a puzzle that challenges our understanding of life and its potential. The cosmos, it seems, is not as barren as we once thought. Enter the world of the International Space Station, where life has not only survived but thrived in ways we never thought possible. In the harsh environment of the International Space Station, a new kind of life form has been discovered. Not alien, but a familiar foe, Enterobacter bugandensis. Imagine, if you will, a setting as far removed from the comfort of our green and blue planet as can be. In the cold, unforgiving vacuum of space, aboard the International Space Station, scientists made an unexpected discovery. Enterobacter bugandensis, a bacteria associated with severe illnesses here on Earth, was found to have not only survived, but thrived in the inhospitable conditions of outer space. But this wasn't the same bacteria we're familiar with. This was something new, something different. The bacteria had mutated into genetically and functionally distinct strains, strains not found anywhere on Earth. This is not merely a case of survival of the fittest, but evolution on a cosmic scale. These mutated strains of Enterobacter bugandensis were found to be surprisingly sociable. They coexisted with other microorganisms, forming a kind of microbial community. But the cooperation didn't stop there. These bacteria even assisted other microorganisms in their survival. It's a testament to life's tenacity and adaptability, even in the most extreme conditions. Now you might be wondering, what's the big deal? Well, here's the kicker. These bacteria became more drug resistant. That's right, not only did they adapt to survive in the harsh environment of space, but they also developed a stronger resistance to the very medicines we use to combat them. In essence, these bacteria are a testament to the resilience and adaptability of life. But it's a new challenge that we face. As we push the boundaries, as we push the boundaries of human exploration, venturing further into the cosmos, we must also navigate the complexities of maintaining health in these new environments. These bacteria have not only survived in space, but they have also become more drug resistant, posing a new challenge for health in space. This discovery isn't just about bacteria in space, it's about understanding how life might evolve in different environments. Let's dive a little deeper into what this could mean for us as we strive to become an interplanetary species. With the discovery of these drug resistant Enterobacter bugandensis bacteria on the International Space Station, we find ourselves facing an unexpected biological puzzle. These hardy strains, defying the odds, not only survived in the harsh conditions of space, but also thrived and evolved into something new. They mutated into genetically and functionally distinct strains that we've never encountered on Earth. Now, this is where things get fascinating and perhaps a little unsettling. These mutated strains were found to coexist with other microorganisms, even aiding their survival. This suggests that life, even at a microscopic level, can adapt and flourish in the most extreme environments, even space. But what does this mean for our dreams of space exploration and colonization? Well, it presents us with a new set of challenges. We must consider the potential health risks these drug-resistant bacteria pose to astronauts and future space colonists. In the contained environment of a spacecraft or a space colony, the spread of such bacteria could be rapid and potentially devastating. Moreover, these findings underscore the importance of understanding the genetic evolution of pathogens. The bacteria we know on Earth may not behave the same way in the vacuum of space, and we must be prepared for that. Now, let's take a moment to appreciate the bigger picture here. This discovery, as unsettling as it may be, 
is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of life. It's a stark reminder that life in all its forms is a force to be reckoned with. As we venture further into the cosmos, we must be prepared to face the unexpected, from mutant bacteria to the unknown. The universe, it seems, is far from being a sterile place.